Monsieur Anthony Blinken, la guerre que nous nous faisons, nous, moi, du moins, moi, la guerre entre moi et Emmanuel Macron a commencé en 2016. Mr. Anthony Blinken, the war between me and Emmanuel Macron has started, had started in 2016. So, I know that during your, uh, your meeting with him at the Elysee Palace, The, the, the dialogue between you and the president of France and its French African colonies was very tough, I know. Monsieur Anthony Blinken, après le coup d'état du Niger, un vrai coup d'état, mais qui est faux? The coup d'état in Niger is a real one. It happened. But it's false. Because its main target is Algeria. Okay? Its main target is Algeria. In addition to your fight with to the war between the secret services of the United States, France, China, Russia, and other countries maybe. Il est facile de remarquer que depuis le coup d'état du Niger, qui a suivi le coup d'état du Mali, qui a suivi le coup d'état du Burkina Faso, qui a suivi le coup d'état en Guinée-Bissau, aucune action terroriste n'a aucune action de terroriste n'a été enregistrée. So, all these groups are controlled by the secret services of France, mainly of the United States, of China, and Russia. Le continent africain, Monsieur Blinken, est le est, est la reine et le ring des puissances de ce monde pour définir un nouvel équilibre. Africa is the ring, is the arena of the war between the powers like United States, China, Russia, England, India now, India, in order to define the new equilibrium. It's this topic. Now, Mr. Anthony Blinken, I had visited Washington and New York in July 2022 in the gardens and parks on Pennsylvania Avenue. United States are missing one of the most important persons, one of the most important spirits, Algerian spirits, in there. It's the face, the spirit of Lunas Matub, Al Thomaturge, Demurge of art born in Algeria in 1956, the same year as the, the Summum Congress, and murdered in 1996, June 1996. Please, I know that you love music. Let me make you listening to just an excerpt. Just an excerpt, excerpt. 
it's likewise if you can say it's the copy the music of the Algerian national anthem Qasam Mr. Anthony Beninkan in United States even in a small soccer match your national anthem is sung in Algeria because of the, the lack of state the Algerian state because it's wrecked because it's a failed state because it's weak the Algerian nation cannot sing the national anthem on them Qasaman Mr. Anthony Blinken, the Constitution of the United States of America is considered stronger than the Human Rights Declaration of 1948, which, which was prepared in San Francisco in the United States and enacted in Paris. La Constitution des États-Unis d'Amérique est considérée comme plus forte que la Déclaration universelle des droits de l'homme qui a été préparée à San Francisco et signée à Paris. Sa proclamation a été faite à Paris. The freedom of speech, the freedom of religion, are sacred in the United States. In Algeria, a journalist and a journalist whose name is Qadi Ihsan is still in the jail in Algeria. He is innocent. And the United States of America, by your voice, Mr. Anthony Blinken, are silent about his case the case of Ihsan Qadi and all the political detainees in Algeria. Les États-Unis d'Amérique sont silencieux par votre voix. Inaudible, Monsieur Anthony Blinken. Vous êtes silencieux sur la détention du journaliste Ihsan Qadi et de tous les autres détenus politiques. It's one of the weaknesses of the United States of America. C'est l'une des faiblesses des États-Unis d'Amérique.